A major focus of our exploration in Istanbul was a wall. Now that might sound pretty boring to most people, but not to my classics degreed husband. Ancient walls bear the marks of heroes. From Achilles at Troy to Davy Crockett at the Alamo, walls are history books written in stone. This particular wall, constructed in triplicate from the Golden Horn to the Bosporus, protected ancient Constantinople for a thousand years. We spent two days exploring the wall and its environs, stretching four and a half miles. Built by the Roman Emperor Theodosian in the 5th century, it was not breached until 1453 by Mehmed the Conqueror, who spent 41 days bombarding it with world-class artillery. Even in ruins, it is an impressive and formidable barrier. But there is a remarkable anomaly built into the fabric of this wall. From its very beginning, it was pierced by 14 openings. People simply have to get back and forth. I believe there is a lesson to be learned here. Human nature prompts us to build walls, but openings in those walls are incredibly useful and necessary. Toastmasters as an institution works hard to build openings where human nature has built walls. Every skill we foster in leadership and in communications is a portal breaching walls that separate us from each other. Currently, Istanbul has five active Toastmasters clubs. I am eager for the time when that number grows to 14, one for every gate in the city's ancient wall.